Hi guys, welcome back to another Tackle with Tara video. And if you're new here, welcome. My name is Tara and I created a new series on my channel where every Sunday I put out a video that hopefully helps motivate and inspire you to tackle your to-do list with me. So it can be anything from cooking, cleaning, organizing, grocery shopping, meal planning, anything that I have written down on my to-do list for the day is what I'm going to be filming to hopefully motivate you guys to get yours done too. So this is everything that I wanted to get done today and I will link these cute printouts in the description box that I got online. They're super inexpensive and I just put them in a sleeve protector so I can keep reusing them. You'll find a different side of me Like someone pretty need A different side of me, yeah So the first thing on my list for the day was Grayson's four month checkup. I cannot believe he is four months already, you guys. Time is flying by way too fast. And I just posted his four month photo on my Instagram if you wanna check it out. There are no stop signs, counting down till we take flight. It's how you make me feel. Now that we're back home, the first thing I'm going to do is gather up all of our linens and throw them in the wash so that they're clean and ready to go for tonight. I washed our bedding a couple days ago, so I'm not gonna be washing that today, but I do end up throwing in another load later with some of the girls' laundry. Now I'm just showing you guys what the main living area of our home currently looks like because that's the next thing I'm going to tackle. And it doesn't matter how clean and organized I get the house looking the night before, by the time I get home from taking the girls to school, it's always a disaster and I just can't function when my house is a mess. So before I'm able to do anything else, I have to pick it up. You'll find a different side of me. And over here in the corner is all of Adam's candle supplies. He recently found a new obsession with making homemade candles, which is so random, but he's actually really good at it. Shocker, I know. This guy is seriously good at everything, but I told him he should open his own Etsy shop, so we'll see if he actually does it. And 
And just when I thought I was done with the dishes, I turn around to find a million more. <laughs> Love that for me. When I was at Target the other day, I saw that they had a new Mrs. Meyerson out on the holiday shelf called Snowdrop, so I decided to try it out, and it smells really nice. It's not too overpowering at all, and I got the hand soap too, and I've been really liking it. Now I'm just straightening up our dining room area before moving on to breaking down some of our recycling. Okay, now moving on to our front porch, I'm just hosing off some of the chalk masterpieces from the girls the other day. The next thing on my to-do list that I keep putting off is making a lash appointment. It's so hard for me to find time to go get them filled, but I've had them for so long and I love the look of them and how quickly it takes me to do my makeup in the morning, so I just cannot quit them yet. Now I'm heading upstairs with our catch-all basket to sort through everything and put it all back where it belongs. Ninety percent of the stuff that ends up in this basket is the girls' clothes from when we changed them out of their school clothes and into their ballet attire, so I'm thinking I need to get another hamper for the laundry room that we can just keep in there so it'll save me a trip from coming upstairs. And now I'm just transferring the linens to the dryer and throwing a load of the girls' laundry into the wash.
Bailey always comes home with so much sand in her shoes and she knows to take them off on the front porch, but I think sometimes she just forgets, so occasionally it'll all get dumped out right here where we store the majority of their shoes right now. But that's the next thing I'm gonna tackle because we can barely close this drawer and half of the shoes in here don't even fit them anymore. So these are all the shoes that no longer fit them. And then since these shoes are more summery, I'm gonna store them in their room. Aside from Shay's Hunter boots from last year, I'm gonna pass those down to Grayson so he can wear them next year. So the only shoes I kept down here are the shoes they wear all the time, but we'll see how long that lasts. Okay, now I'm gonna organize our shower products because what we have going on right now just is not working and it's driving me nuts. So I got these bins from Target the other day to hopefully organize them all a bit better. So this is what it ended up looking like. It's so much more organized and just makes our shower look a lot less cluttered. Okay, moving on to our backyard, Chloe is constantly jumping up on our couch out here with her muddy paws, so I just wanted to quickly wipe them down. These couches are weather and stain proof, so thankfully they're super easy to wipe off, and all I'm using to do that is a wet microfiber cloth. But that is going to be it for today's video. I hope this motivated you guys to get up and start crossing things off of your to-do list. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you all very soon. Bye.
Take a stop for us.